hey guys and welcome back to another video so today is going to be budgeting with me yes and i'm using the spread like the calendar spread let me know if you guys like it better like this or you guys will want it like let me see if i can find it real quick or you guys will want it like a, a june budget like how this is broken down to. so let me know in the comment section below so let's get started so of course i'm a little colorful and i know october is halloween month and i'm using colorful stuff but my plan is colorful so this is why i chose these colors but we're gonna start over here so i chose hustle because october is gonna be hustle month because i need to pay down my debt and make up for everything i spent last month but we're gonna move forward so i need to hustle so my goals for the month of october is going to be i get i did write love yourself read a book sell five items i'm gonna try at that again fifty dollars extra to freedom which is my credit card fifty dollars extra to student loan and i'm gonna try to track my spending so let's see how this works out for the month of october oh and i'm gonna put since I did 15 no spend days, I am going to try 20 no spend days. I got faith. I got faith that I can do the 20 no spend days because October is going to be a month that I'm going to try my best to not spend at all. And then I love quotes. Um, if anybody know me, I love my quotes. If you see me on Instagram, which is Brina with a twist, I love my quotes. Good things are going to happen. Yes, they are. And then this one down here says, love, laughter, and smiles. And can't stop, won't stop. So the first is rent. This is already paid off. So I'm going to put a check for that because October's rent is already paid. Then here, oh, I thought that's, here is my cell phone bill and this one is a hundred and fifty dollars that comes out automatically and then here is my cable which is 142 I don't have too many bills I noticed either that or I'm missing something because I don't have a cheat sheet in front of me so I I'm like I don't got that much bills but credit cards and the 26 is my freedom credit card I'm gonna put CC and the minimum payment on this is I believe it's 80 now then the 27th is my student loan which right now I don't have to make any payments but I am because we have no interest until December 31st and there is no minimum balance. I am just using whatever minimum balance I'm doing for my debt free chart, um, which is I think $14, but I'm going by that. And then I don't know why I got all this hair everywhere. Then the 28th is Capital One. And the minimum payment for this is usually 128 so, and I don't have really no appointments. I know I just work in, on the office Mondays and Thursdays, which I probably should have put that in there. But yeah, guys, this is my budget. I hope this, I didn't forget anything. Let me just double check September. September, this was uh, the cable, which I have, my rent. And then, yeah, guys, I think that's all because I used to have a lot of credit cards. That's probably why it looks so less because I used to have a, a whole bunch of credit cards that I needed to pay. But luckily, thank God that I paid them off. 
so yeah guys this is my spread i want to put some more stickers like i feel like it's just plain and i'm using the create 365 from the happy planner and let's see what else can i use because i love their stickers i didn't use mine this time because oh how about we use one of these good vibes over here in this because this is an empty box so i'm gonna put that there so i'm really really gonna strive really hard to pay off my three and four because i am at 500 dollars, guys on my student loan i'm so excited but yeah guys this is my spread for the month of october and hopefully those 20 no spend days i'm hoping that i can do it but yeah if you like this type of video please give me a thumbs up don't forget to share and subscribe and i'll be seeing everyone in my next video